All right, this is Little Lamb Dragonfly. I um, made a video for this a couple weeks ago, but um, I realized that I made some mistakes. and I didn't really like the way it turned out. So instead of teaching you it all over again, I might as well teach you the whole entire song. I just taught the intro, really. Um, so I thought, you know, might as well teach the whole thing. Um, in the first video, I did finger style, but I soon realized that it's done with a pick. Um, so yeah, I thought might as well just do it again. So here it is, main intro part. The picking pattern is just all down strokes. There's nothing too fancy here. So D chord here, twice. Once you get to that third time, you wanna hammer on that pinky finger. And then, then on the fourth time, you wanna pull it off. That's pretty simple. Next, what you wanna do is slide all the way down here. This is first string, uh, eighth fret, second string, 10th fret to get this. Next, what you wanna do is do that D shape, but on the seventh fret, so that's first and third string, seventh, and then second string, eighth to get this. It's all together. Okay, and then you wanna keep that D shape, but you wanna move it up a string and then onto the fifth fret. So that's fourth and second string, fifth fret, and then third string, sixth fret to get this. And then A7. It's all together. Um, the hard part really is getting from here all the way down to here. You might go a little bit farther and not go far enough. Um, so just practice that. So once you get to the A7 part, you wanna do this chord here. I don't know what you would call it, but it's fifth fret, first string, and then seventh fret, second and third string to get this. And what you wanna do is a, a pregio that sounds like this. So that's three, one, two, three, one, two, three. all together right so now I'm gonna go to C chord here I'd like to play it like this you can play it like this it's up to you um, here's like the main strumming part it's mostly downstream well it's all downstream I don't know why I said mostly but it's all downstream down Oh my God, <laughs> down pick. Right? And into this D6 here, which is D7, except for one string over. So instead of like this, you play like this. D7, regular. And he does this weird chord here, which is bar on the first fret, second and first string, and then second fret, third string to get this. To G, you play like this or like this. Back to C. And you play that twice, so I'm gonna play it for you. of the intro is regular D with the pinky on so take the pinky off take the middle finger off the last D doesn't count so it's with the pinky pinky off middle finger off 
and then straight to the first chord, which is like B, what is this, B, B minor, B something. So the whole intro all together sounds like this. So yeah, that's the whole intro. This is the first chord of the uh, rhythm part. So he says, I have no answer for you. When he says little lamb, you just want to move your three fingers up one string. Little lamb, I can help you out. E minor. But I cannot help you in. So that's E minor to A to D. So all together. So from the D, you want to go to this chord. I don't know what you would call it, but it's this without the middle finger. It says sometimes I think that life is to E. So that's like the song part of the drag of the little lamb part, and he goes back to the intro where he goes. So that's pretty much the little lamp part. Now the dragonfly part is a little bit more interesting. Like some weird chords going on. Um, so when you, the first chord is a regular E. Dragonfly. Fly, fly, fly. And then when he goes to window, you want to do this chord again. Window. Take that pinky off now. It says you and I to B7. To have a way to and we'll go back to regular E. Go. So all together that's Pretty sure the pig and pan is just down 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 but i'm pretty sure you can get fancy with it and then uh, in between each chord there's like some crazy thing he does the you know whatever it is um but i don't really know how he does that i'm just showing you like the rhythm part so next which is the last part of the dragon fifth part he says don't know so that's a don't know he does this weird um Kind of like a, a D7 shape, but up one string. So that's um, second string, second fret, third string, first fret, fourth string, second fret. It's really awkward. So A. So from here he goes to to this, which is I think is E7 or E6. So don't know why. Oh, oh, oh. And then he goes to, um, I guess you could call this, 
I don't even know, man. F, F major or B? I don't know. F, A F major something. But it's this shape here. And he goes to this shape, which is a bar across the uh, fourth and then second string, fifth fret, and then third and fourth string, sixth fret. So, all together. Seven A seven to D back to this shape, like from before, and then to regular B, which is basically um, bar across the second fret, and then on the fourth fret of the second third and fourth string so you get this since you come come on home it goes back to the dragonfly part i mean the little lamb part it's That's pretty much the whole entire thing. Um, I would play it, but the song's kind of long, and uh, I feel like I'd get tired over time. But uh, yeah, man, that's Little Lamb Dragonfly by Wings. Um, yeah. See you guys in the next one.